Hey everybody, it's Lauren, personal trainer at the Dublin Rec Center. This is my son, Ryder, and I'm hoping everybody's staying healthy and finding ways to stay active. So in order to help with that, Ryder and I are gonna do a workout with you guys today. I've created a workout that is made up of mini circuits. So each circuit has three exercises. Ryder and I are going to demonstrate each exercise today in the, all three circuits so that you will then be able to do this workout at home. This, a copy of this workout can be found on the Dublin Community Rec Center page in the fitness landing page. So let's get moving. For circuit number one, the exercises will be a standard plank, four lateral high knees plus a burpee, and then we'll wrap it up with a squat. So for the first exercise, we are going to do a standard plank. Ryder's going to demonstrate a straight arm plank, and I'm going to do a forearm plank. Keep in mind with the forearm plank, you want to have a nice 90 degree angle with your arm, so your elbow is directly under your shoulder. And then you want to have a nice flat body. So flat as a table. All right, we'll hold this for about five seconds. Okay, great. Second exercise is gonna be four lateral high knees plus a burpee. I'm going to be doing the standard burpee, which looks like this, a jump, a jump out plank, and then a jump to finish it off. Ryder's gonna do a little bit of a modified version. He's gonna take out the jump. He will bring his arms up, put his hands down, walk it out, walk it back, and with his arms up. So either version, great exercise. So we'll go ahead and demonstrate that. So we'll start with the high knees. Two, 
and three. Okay, that wraps up circuit two. For circuit number three, the exercises will be a straight arm plank plus some mountain climbers, five jumping jacks plus five squats repeated for a certain amount of time, and bicycle crunches. So the first exercise will be the straight arm plank plus the mountain climbers. So we'll each get into the plank position. Okay, Ryder's going to bring his knees up towards his chest in a straight fashion, there we go. I'm going to take my knees and cross them to bring them to the opposite elbow. So my right knee will go to my left elbow, my left leg will go to my right elbow. All right, we'll demonstrate about five of these. jumping jacks plus five squats. Now for jumping jacks, you can do a full jumping jack or you can bring it in a little bit tighter and do a quicker jumping jack. So a little bit like this. Okay, five and then five squats. Two, three, four, five. Okay, then you will repeat that sequence for the 30 seconds or 40 seconds, whatever time is set on the, on the plan. Finally, we're gonna end up with some bicycle crunches. So for this, okay, all right, you are going to put your hands behind your head, and the goal is to get your elbow to the opposite knee, or the motion towards that. Okay, so you, so in slow motion, it would look like this, Okay, then you can speed it up and try to reach those elbows to those opposite knees. Again, if you don't touch your knee, totally fine. It's the motion of going towards it. All right, so we'll just demonstrate this. A way to modify this, you can take out your arms, lay your head down, and just simply bicycle. All right, everybody. That wraps up circuit three and the workout. Thank you so much.